Senegalese peanut farmers are eagerly awaiting Chinese buyers to purchase the upcoming harvest. Chinese economic operators are always welcome to the groundnut basin. We are waiting for them to start the next marketing year set for November and December 2015. Chinese buyers purchase the peanuts at significantly higher prices than the local market. Peanuts are regularly sold between 250 and 300 Central African francs, compared to the usual local fixed price of 200. I would like to express my satisfaction with Senegal cooperation with China. The Chinese bought our products last year at good prices, and this helped us very much as farmers. However, some farmers believe not everyone is benefiting from the growing trade. We heard that some people among us sell to the Chinese their products at very interesting prices, while we are not informed. And in the meantime, we are suffering by selling our products to people who don't pay us well and others that are taking advantage of us in the transactions. As a result of the increased Chinese demand, the government of Senegal has encouraged farmers to increase peanut crop production. The government says the export market to China has boomed since being opened up to Senegalese imports. For two years, China's doors were closed to peanuts from Senegal due to sanitary and phytosanitary issues related to the quality of peanuts that were supposed to come from Senegal. Any peanut coming from West Africa, Gambia and elsewhere was considered to be coming from Senegal. A protocol was signed last year and this year the implementation of this protocol gave extraordinary results. Despite the government's enthusiasm, local peanut oil companies say they are struggling to supply their factories as peanut farmers are rushing to Chinese buyers. Today our factory is temporarily inactive. We are in May and it was during this month that the factories were running till the month of October. Today, in two months, we are done. It means that there is a real lack of seeds. We had to split among our four mills 100,000 tons of peanuts that is extremely preoccupying and extremely serious for the future of oil mills in Senegal. For now, however, most within Senegal's peanut industry seem to be extremely positive about the growing Chinese market. And that's good news for the economy as a whole. The industry is a major employer, with almost half of the country's cultivatable land being used to farm the ground nut. Andrew Thompson, CCTV.